a weekly guest, a weekly guest on our show. Of course, it is Dr. Connie Case Bolt Carver to my far left. We call you the hormone doctor behind your back. Did you know that? <laughs> well, people call it to my face too, so well, I'm, good, I'm okay well, with that. that. That's how you started, kind of. It in, is. In, uh, wellness mm -hmm. by design. It is. Hormones. Yep. So we're going to go back today with all the things you do, all the services, and how much you've grown. Let's get back to the basics today. Yes, well, part of the reason we start with hormones is it is one of the big things we lose as we age. You've heard this before, but it bears repeating. Around age 30 is when they start to dwindle. And at first it's so imperceptible that you don't really notice. But then as the years roll by and you realize you're not sleeping as well, you know, then you're, if you're a woman, you're going through menopause and you get those night sweats and hot flashes. You lose that romantic attraction for yeah. your partner, which can terribly affect, you know, marriages and relationships. Sure. And a lot of women kind of throw up their hands and they don't know what to do. They, they have been told that hormones are dangerous. Right. They might get breast cancer or they might have some terrible outcome. Mm -hmm. So we're kind of that beacon of hope. Well, that's, clear that up. Yes, mis because so what happened was there was a study that determined that women who took hormones were at higher risk. But when you reanalyze the data, it was because the hormones were synthetic and they were given by mouth. So when we do hormone replacement therapy, we're very careful to do it correctly, which means we don't use synthetics. We're using bioidentical only, and we don't get estrogen by mouth. Yeah. So that's the critical thing. Plus, what also sets us apart is most other doctors are only given women either estrogen or estrogen plus a progestin. We also add that third magic hormone called testosterone. Yeah, I like those. Yes. <laughs> so <laughs> it turns out that we, you know, we think of that as the male hormone and men do need about 10 times, real in reality, 10 times mm -hmm. more than women, mm -hmm. but women do need a smidgen because that's what gives women their libido back, their self-confidence, their energy, ability to work out of the gym. That's so great. you know, and, and, and if you go to see the good doctor, uh, I know that you used to give out a big sheet and you would check off symptoms yes. you were having. Yes. It's just amazing how many things are, oh, yeah. are related to low hormones. I mean, yeah, low, low, hormones. low, low hormones. So yeah. uh, mood, sleep, anxiety, of course we mentioned, uh, yeah, irritability, yeah, um, vaginal dryness, inability to have relations. Um, again, low sex drive, muscle, joints, aches, mm -hmm. um, even heart palpitations can be from low testosterone. Wow. And you have so. to take a blood test first. Yes, so we're very, you know. we're very scientific. We're going to measure everyone's blood before they come uh, before they come in to see me, mm -hmm. and then our team will advise them as to whether they're a candidate or not, um, and then we'll present them options. Now, our favorite option, and you've heard this before, are pellets, and this time I brought a sample of two pellets, pellet. so people can see what they look so like. So this is what would be inserted. Yes. yes. So we have a a whole cabinet in the back is kept under lock and key because yep. testosterone is a controlled substance. But when we determine the dosage, and of course it's very individualized mm -hmm. based on blood work and so forth, um, when it comes time to do the procedure, we're gonna open up these little uh, containers and they're literally, I'll like show the camera here in just a second. Yeah, so here's a couple different sizes. You can tell and they can fit in those little bitty tubes. Yeah, the right. These yeah. aren't big, huge things here. Yeah, they're tiny still, little, again, like the size of a large grain of rice. Of course, they're sterile. We would never dump them into the palm of our hand. Of course, this is just to show you <laughs> guys just at a home demo. how small they are. It's just are. amazing the power, because once these are inserted, it's a quick, painless, yeah. five minute in women, about eight minute in mm. men procedure. They don't feel we it. Because we cry. We, men, <laughs> no, I'm kidding, kidding. But once they're in, within about a week, uh, it's always about a week for me. You just start feeling this amazing difference. Like yeah. you just feel like you're up like and off. You're back on your game. Yeah. You're you're feeling good again. And again, there's nothing so. to the process. Now you might some people, depending upon their testosterone levels, I keep saying the estrogen or yeah. whatever, uh, you might put two or three in. Yes. But so just under your skin. Yeah. And it's the, in the fat layer, and they slowly they slowly dissolve. Yeah. And because they're just a very slow, it keeps a nice steady state. You're in that zone of therapeutic that window. Right. Uh, and it just and then in three to four months, most women it's three months. Men can sometimes go four, even five months. We're going to recheck the blood, and then we you know we start with usually the right hip. And the next time we just put on the left yeah. hip again. Painless procedure, Nothing seamless. Good. Uh, we try to stay on time so people are in and out within 30 minutes typically. I mean, yeah. how many doctor's offices can you do that? Say that? Tell them exactly where you are. So we're at 850 mm -hmm. South Pleasantburg, uh, which is just a block from Cleveland Street. Yep. And um, we are developing some YouTube videos that people can watch. But in the meantime, we encourage people 
to come to our seminar. We're having a workshop this coming Thursday. I think it's the 19th. 19th. Mm -hmm. Yeah, six o'clock. Uh, we do ask that you call and register for that. Right. Uh, so we would love to see, you know, if, if, so if you're that person who's lost their sex drive or having night sweats or hot flashes, or if you're a can't man. Can't lose weight. Yeah, you can't lose the weight. belly fat for the. Yeah. So, you know, don't, at least come in and get your blood work done. And then yeah. we'll tell you if you're a candidate to, to work with us on hormones. Because you have to do that yes. first. Yeah. To know what Thank to you, do. Dr. Connie. First. This is very informative. This Thanks, is good, that's good stuff. Well, speaking of good stuff, look at this. This is the good stuff right here. Spartanburg is in for a big treat. The Greek festival is on its way. Jamarcus has all the yummy details when we come back.